At noon on December 4, 2023, the Long March 2C carrier rocket was ignited and lifted off at the Jiuquan Satellite Launch Center in China. The Egypt 2 satellite and the second set of A and B satellites of Xingqi 1 were sent into the predetermined orbit in the three star with one stone method, successfully completing the 499th launch of the Long March series of launch vehicles. This launch is also China's 55th orbital mission this year. According to the agreement between China and Egypt on the Egypt 2 satellite project, China has developed and launched for Egypt a small optical remote sensing satellite with a resolution of 2 meters, panchromatic, slash 8 meters, multispectral. It uses the Satellite Assembly and Integration Testing Center assisted by the Chinese government to conduct final assembly and testing of satellites. After the satellite is delivered in orbit, it will serve Egypt's land and resource utilization, water conservancy, agriculture, and other fields. The Egypt 2 satellite project is China's first international cooperation satellite project to adopt a complete foreign aid project management model and is a milestone in the field of China-Egypt space cooperation. During the joint development process of the satellite, China provided Egyptian technical personnel with full satellite system level design training and final assembly test operation training. Egyptian technical personnel were deeply involved in the entire process of satellite design, development and testing. The second group of A. B satellites of Xingqi-1 is provided by China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation Great Wall Corporation as the general contractor to provide launch services and is mainly used to provide wide area comprehensive sensing satellite application services. It is understood that this satellite project makes Egypt the first country to carry out satellite cooperation with China under the framework of the joint construction of the Belt and Road, and is a landmark achievement of China-Egypt cooperation in the joint construction of the Belt and Road. As a cooperation project in the high-tech field of aerospace between China and Egypt, what special considerations were taken during the design process of this satellite? What changes has it brought to Egypt's aerospace development? Egypt 2 is a low-orbit optical remote sensing satellite. It uses the mature satellite platform CAST-1000 developed in China and is equipped with a high image quality optical camera, operating in an orbit more than 600 kilometers high. In the future, the remote sensing images it acquires will be used in Egypt's agriculture, forestry, urban planning and construction, land resources, environmental protection, disaster monitoring and management and other fields, bringing tangible benefits to Egypt and surrounding countries and regions. As a satellite tailor made for Egypt, the Egypt 2 satellite has more personalized considerations than China's previous remote sensing satellites. Developers from the 5th Academy of China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation said that since the satellite will be independently controlled by Egypt after it is launched into orbit, and Egypt currently has relatively few ground measurement and control stations, this puts forward higher requirements for the satellite's autonomous operation capability in orbit. In addition, in order to operate safely and stably, satellites must be easy to use and easy to use. As orbital debris increases day by day, spacecraft working in orbit are at greater risk of being hit. How to enable Egyptian researchers to avoid space debris through simple operations is also a factor that needs to be considered during development. In this regard, the development team has designed more than 20 on-orbit autonomous safety modes and specially developed functions such as one-click debris avoidance and on-orbit autonomous survival mode to provide strong support for Egypt's subsequent satellite commercial operations. 
the Egypt-2 satellite project witnessed the close cooperation between China and Egypt. It not only provides Egypt with a satellite that can widely serve its national economy and people's livelihood, but also makes Egypt the first country in Africa to have satellite assembly and testing capabilities, and the first country in Africa to localize satellite development. A developer from the 5th Academy of China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation said that China has accumulated many successful cases in the field of optical remote sensing satellites and has complete facilities. But Egypt has not yet achieved independent development of an entire satellite. Therefore, during the cooperation process, the Chinese development team not only delivered the initial prototype of the satellite, but also taught the Egyptian team how to design, verify, integrate, and test satellites. In terms of satellite development, we have gradually transitioned from focusing on ourselves and the other side as the supplement, to focusing on the other side and us as the supplement, and finally achieved the goal of independent design and development by Egypt. Through this cooperation model, Egypt has built hard and soft power in satellite development with China's assistance. In addition to having an in-orbit remote sensing satellite, Egypt has built a full-chain infrastructure for satellite development, including the Satellite Assembly and Integration Test Center, AIT Center, the ground control system for operating and controlling satellites, and the ground application system for generating images. At the same time, this cooperation also helped Egypt cultivate local aerospace talents. It is understood that since the beginning of the project construction, the Egyptian side has modeled the position setting of the Chinese side and allocated a satellite development team accordingly, and is deeply involved in all aspects of satellite design, testing, final assembly, review, and other aspects. The Egypt-2 satellite project was officially launched in September 2019. It includes a small remote sensing satellite, a ground measurement and control station and a ground application system, and is implemented by the China Academy of Space Technology, a subsidiary of China Aerospace Science and Technology Corporation. It is a landmark project to carry out in-depth international cooperation in the field of aerospace high-tech. With the support of China's Ministry of Commerce, China International Development Cooperation Agency, China National Space Administration and other units. The Egypt-2 satellite project is China's first international cooperation satellite project to adopt a complete foreign aid project management model. It is a landmark achievement of China-Egypt high-quality joint construction of the Belt and Road. Haytham Medhait Alkaya, project management manager of the Egyptian Space Agency, said that the Egypt-2 satellite project has laid a solid foundation for the development of Egypt's space industry. It has promoted the training of Egyptian aerospace professionals and helped Egypt become the leader in the field of aerospace satellites in Africa and the Middle East. The successful launch of this satellite is not only a milestone in the field of China-Egypt aerospace cooperation, but will also serve Egypt's Vision 2030 in many important fields such as agriculture, mineral exploration, and urban planning. During the joint development process of the satellite, China provided Egyptian technical personnel with training on whole satellite system level design and final assembly test operations. The Egyptian technical personnel were deeply involved in the entire process of satellite design, development, and testing. Through the cooperation on the Egypt-2 satellite project, Egypt's industrial system including upstream, satellite development, midstream, ground facility construction and operation, and a downstream, satellite data processing, sharing, and application has been further improved.
Gao Greenhua, Deputy Director of the Earth Observation and Data Center of the China National Space Administration, said that after the Egypt-2 satellite project is delivered, it will drive Egypt's independent satellite development, independent final assembly and integration testing, ground measurement and operation control, and satellite data processing and sharing. In the future, China is willing to work with Egypt to explore cooperation such as the sharing and exchange of satellite remote sensing data. Between the two countries, continue to expand the breadth and depth of aerospace cooperation between the two countries and continue to contribute aerospace capabilities to building a China-Egypt community with a shared future in the new era. Egypt is the first country to carry out joint satellite development with China under the framework of the joint construction of the Belt and Road Initiative. In 2014, China and Egypt signed the Agreement on Cooperation in the Field of Aerospace Technology and Remote Sensing Applications and decided to strengthen cooperation in the fields of satellite development, satellite launch aerospace measurement and control, satellite applications, and data sharing. In January 2019, China and Egypt signed an implementation agreement for the Egypt 2 satellite. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more great content. See you next time.